Oh, hi there, Team Fuzzle Wuzzles. No, hi there, Team Wuzzles. And so, I was playing Puggle Mr. Dungeon, right? And then it got to this scene where there was a cutscene and stuff, and then I had to stop playing it because, hey, I can't do cutscenes without you people watching over my bike. No, I'm not I'm not that bothered by it. It's just, you know, I, 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 I don't know. I wish I had seen the cutscene personally, but I can't because it's not on camera. And yes. I do play off screen, but you know, it's just stuff that you guys don't need to see. Like me naked. No, I'm kidding. Um, so I already got a question of the day. Uh, I was in the bathroom and I went to the bathroom. Like, like I didn't go like number two or three or whatever. I don't even know if there's a number three. I just went into the bathroom and I saw like a like a zzzzing and I was like, was that a fly? That that'd be weird if there was a fly in my bathroom. I usually keep it clean around here. And then, I look real close, it's on the window, it's a uh, wasp, and I'm like, oh, well, that, that's lovely. So I got around to killing it, and uh, and then I, you know, threw it out, and then I came back in, there was another one. Killed it, too. And repeat the process three times. So yeah, why the hell are there wasps in my bathroom, is the question of the day. Anyways, one morning a mirage came into view. When they heard it, it was the great glacier in the distant north. Bray and the others vowed they would visit it one day. Now it's back to work and training so they can make it to the glacier someday. And since then I did do a few missions. Uh, ooh. Hmm? Is this another dream? <gasps> that voice! I, I think I can hear it! Hear me. Ray. Ray can hear me. I need Ray. Please help. I can't. I couldn't catch most of it. What is she trying to tell me? The voice is fading. Wait, I want to hear more. No good. The dream's slipping away. Okay, so something creepy looked at my base, and then it went away, and then I had a weird dream. So I say creepy because if it wasn't creepy, why the heck would it be in the bushes staring at me from there and not just visit and say hello in the morning? You know, be neighborly. Morning, Ray. Huh? What's up with you? You seem kind of out of it this morning. Well, nothing was out of me the other day when I didn't sleep at all. You know, still tired? Couldn't you sleep well last night? Uh, me? I guess it's no big surprise he's worried. I guess I better explain the whole mess to Matt. What? So you've been having a dream the past few nights? I don't dream about anything except for bacon! No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Get it? He's a pig. Bacon is made for pigs. It'd be ironic if he had a taste for bacon. <laughs> Sorry, it was a bad joke. And in those dreams you've been hearing the same voice? The same voice that was calling for help when you first came here? Mm hmm. Then, then what does that voice say? I love how there's just a wobble wobble animation that explains everything that's happened so far and it just it makes sense. No need for a massive flashback. Really? You can't hear the words, huh? <gasps> Sorry, Ray, but I, I don't know. Maybe maybe the Pokemon who wanted your help, Ray, is trying to communicate with you using some kind of telepathy or something, huh? I don't even know what voice to say that in, like what sort of tone. That's gotta be it. See, I knew the tone for that word, right? That sentence right there, but sometimes I don't pick up on the tone immediately, and then it comes off a little weird. And it couldn't get through to your dreams when you were first when you first came here, right? That makes it sound even more likely. I bet that Pokemon's been like broadcasting for help this whole time. The whole time? But there must have been some problem. So you never heard it until now. You say you the you heard the words last night. You heard more last night than you did in any dream before that. So maybe you two are, I don't know, getting in sync or something. Oh, like um, like a team attack, sort of? Because you have to be in sync for those? I, okay, I don't know. 
Maybe it'll be even clearer next time. Maybe. I get it. It could be true. Yeah, that makes sense. Because, you know, the mind and body, sometimes, I'll explain this. I'm going to just pause the game. Pause the game. They're going to do, like, pause button somewhere. Anyways, uh, when you get, like, a transplant or something or blood transfusion, whenever your body needs some sort of thing, like an organ, uh, they have to find a compatible one. Otherwise, your body will reject it and fight it, thinking it's some sort of invader. It's a monster. I gotta stop with guys. But no, it's actually just, you know, your body can't really tell. It's used to just fighting things off 24-7. It's never used to getting a brand new organ. But, you know, uh, sometimes even after it accepts that the organ that it needed as a transplant is all right it takes time to adjust to the organ so maybe it's like that i've been getting these telepathic ray things whatever like the psychicness is coming to me but like my body hasn't adjusted to it like it accepts that this isn't harmful but it's still you know piecing it together piece by piece in my mind that this is a this is b this is c like it's coming in right it's not being projected away with some sort of magical shield. The signal is coming, but we're still translating it in our minds. That is most likely not what is happening because that's a little complicated. So, yeah, but hey, I hope that um, I made a little bit of sense that the body cannot always accept what is given to it. Why was I called to this world? The answer to all my mysteries. It's not here. It's not today. Once you figure out where that Pokemon is, we'll go save her at once. Don't worry, I'll be with you. Yay, teamwork. Anyways, uh, raffle place, I did that. I won something, I don't recall what. Ah, Pelipa! I'm just glad there's more plot today, because that way I can record tons and tons. Instead of just playing until some plot interrupts my playing. It's like, either I get to record happily, or I get to play happily, but I never get to do them endlessly, because there's a lot of mid, like, tiny things I gotta do in between that are just off-screen things. Anyways, what could this be? Those look like bounties or something, like the gray. It's some kind of notice. Let me see. Matt, read the notice. Wait, Pokemon can read? I'm kidding. <laughs> hmm? It's a notice from Happy! Apparently, they've been getting reports of suspicious Pokemon that's been spotted lurking around the post town. We should take caution when traveling and keep our windows and doors locked. We don't have a door lock. I mean, yeah, we don't have a door lock. Or that's what they say, anyway. Uh, there have always been suspicious Pokemon in post town, though. We got into plenty of trouble first hand because of them. Scraggy! Shakes fist off screen. But maybe they sent out this kind of notice because they're worried about the Pokemon might be even more dangerous than the Ponyard Brothers or the enemies in the dungeons? That's actually kind of uh, not uh, reassuring because last I checked, I have gotten my ass kicked by so many tough Pokemon. Like, yeah, we can take on the bosses, but like, I ran into a Shandalure, which kicked my ass. And then I ran into a, uh, what do you call it, a uh, Haxorus or something? I kicked my ass too. Basically, my ass is getting beat if I ever go into the super dangerous parts of the dungeons. But, let's go pick up our berries. Yeah. This is basically an infinite berry thing. You put one in, but you get three, right? Yeah, you get three. So, basically, it's infinite berries. And berries are like 100 HP each when you use it. So... I technically don't have a reason to be losing ever. It's just I don't like using healing items all that often because it feels weird. Litwick is so adorable in this game. What are you doing today? Oh, nothing, little friend. Ah, we got a zip strike, a blitzel, or whatever. It's a blitzel which turns into a zip strike. No, I didn't want to go that way. I, I didn't want to go that way. No, I didn't. <sighs> hey, Palpatone, what's up? You know what? I don't have any instance. Uh, random tickets, I've got to wait a day for it, so I don't want to do that. Scratch tickets, I'm all game for that, brah. Yeah, boy. Oh, wait, what are the prizes today? I should have probably checked them before just, whatever. Radar orb sounds pretty cool, okay. Oh, yeah! Okay. Uh, eeny, meeny, miny, mow! Damn it! No, I don't even care. I only want the radar orb. I didn't even want to click on that one. You okay, whatever. So I got the radar orb, which is basically like the x-ray specs, but a one-time use. It shows everything on the map on that floor, which is kind of cool, actually. Very, 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 very helpful if you're, like, in danger and you want to just figure out which way to avoid it. I 
think I can do that. Whenever we're recording, I'm gonna try and get in one of these scratch tickets. Remind me if I miss it, because I love scratch tickets, and I, it's a little reward for myself. But I do have a lot of supplies now, so I should be able to build something. Yeah, I don't even know what I'm gonna build, but I got supplies, so... Ooh! <laughs> um... What's a detour guide? Dungeons have secret detours where the treasures wait. This is a shop that tells you all sorts of things about them. As it gets upgraded, you'll be able to buy items that make detours too. Oh, that is kawaii. Sun current treasure. This is a game where you dive into the water and collect treasures. You may find rare items among them. Tilt the 3DS system to play. Tilt 3DS. I didn't do jack crap. Huh. Oh, that must be when it gets unlocked. I'm not smart. With this field, you can grow eye drop, eye drop seeds. Plant one and it'll grow and harvest. I don't know what eye drop. What? You know what? I don't care. Warp seeds. Quick seeds. I get that these two, I know what these do. This will warp you somewhere random. This will make you move one step faster than usual and it wears off in a little bit. So basically, this one's like agility. What the heck is an eye drop seed? Is it like. Oh, that'd be so cool. You just pour it in, and then you know, like your Sharingan or Rinnegan activates, or your Byakugan, and you can see through the walls for a little bit. That's probably what it does, like the X-ray specs, but it's temporary. Oh, that is cool. I might just get that. Uh, blinker seeds, totter seeds, sleep seeds. I love how there's just ways to harvest tons of seeds. Uh, can I get the Dragon Dojo? I've been actually eyeing that for quite a while. I can! Awesome! Dragon Dojo! Yeah! Alright, come on, you two slackers! Wait a minute. I like that pond where it is. Could you leave that there? Oh no, no, they're gonna, they're gonna destroy the pond. Yeah, I just removed our only source of fresh water, I believe, for a dojo. Yeah, it's okay. The dungeon, uh, the dojo looks okay, but really, it's kind of small compared to even girder. I mean, you could only fit four girders up there, and then the flame thing is kind of small too. Maybe it's just like that because it's. Uh, supposed to be compressed in size i mean it is a 3ds game they're not that big in size would you look at that it's done we built you a dragon dojo for you oh my god it's a dino oh my god guys i think i have used the dragon dojo because i know you done your dojo before yo yo my gojo to tojo machacho Alrighty, uh see you later bro we better prepare some new land ah oh, crap we're filled up in this one no we can prepare new land, but okay, fine. I'll go do that later. Oh, his clearing skill went up. I don't know what that means. I think I've come up with something new. Yeah, that's right. I can prepare land to be the cool creek side now. Want to try? Yeah, sure, whatever. Cool creek side. That actually sounds really, uh, I hate to say cool after that. It really sounds really interesting. I said really twice there. Wow, I suck at this whole speaking concept. It sounds interesting because cool would imply there's lakes and water there, and I figure we need some of that because uh, I just... Got rid of the last source of drinking water. I mean, we have a giant river around us, but whatever. Well, when you want to prepare some land, just get the materials and stop by. Oh, and... My skills as a carpenter have gotten a bit better. Epic poses. Like, look at the background. It's like background dancers and everything. Now I'll be able to retrofit the facilities we've already built. That means you can upgrade them. Yeah! Woohoo! I'm Mario! Yay! At first thing I'm upgrading is the berry one. I want more berries, bro. Berries just come in handy. Alright, what's up with this uh, dojo? How does it work? Welcome to the dragon dojo. I'll help you work on your dragon type moves for a hunt. Yeah, boy! Uh, I'm gonna train my double chop. Because I don't know why. Uh, dragon rage, no matter what, always does 30 damage. So I'm just gonna keep that at 20 PP. It's very helpful. It is. Especially against steel types, who I'm not effective against. Screw that. I'll do a set amount of damage. Dragon Chop, though, it's just really helpful against everything else, so let's test it out. There's no fairy types in this game, so everything gets hit, either half effectively, or just Dragon Raged. Uh, yeah. Alright, let's do it. Uh, I wonder what the effects of training are, actually. Ow, he just headbutted me, what the fuck? It got... grew a little bit? What? What? That's it? You can use it once a day, and then on top of that... Oh, hey, what's companion mode? I, I heard a note announcement about that, but I didn't really bother to click on it. I'll, I'll check it out in a little bit. Hold on. Um, status. Ray. Eh. Eh. Hold on. Did it do anything? I don't... I don't know if it did anything at all. That's kind of awkward. I'm, I'm sure it does something later. Also, today is the ice V-Way, which basically means I'm screwed... Oh, more water! Yay, yum, 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 yum. Oh, not there. I was referring to the little, little tiny little... 
There was a little pond right here and it's gone. Oh, no, that sucks. Hello, Petalil. You're happy looking today. What is that? Oh, it's Cottony. I'm stupid. I always get those two mixed up. Where's the little water thing? You guys saw that. Somebody rewind and look at the water thing. Got the ticket, got the training, and got this. I love how there's like a little Animal Crossing built into this. There's an, You can talk to the villagers, not villagers, uh, friends and stuff like that. Oh, there's a campfire. We should set that up. Come on. Come on, Matt. Set that fire up, boy. No? Okay. Hmm. Anyways, we should go into town. Suspiciousness. Ooh, Quagasayana. There's so much plot today. Hmm, hello there. Good timing. Can you give this to the Signora at the inn? Hmm. The Signora? Who's that? Yeah, is that, that, is that, a, is that a Pokemon? You mean Tuana, right? Ah, oh, okay, okay. Mm-hmm. Quagasayana, hand in some money. Ooh. Better... Giving us money? This is for my bill yesterday. I went to the inn's restaurant yesterday for dinner. Hmm. But I was so laid back that I forgot to bring any money with me. Hmm. I didn't remember until after I finished eating. Hmm. Far too late. Hmm. So the signori just let me put it on credit. You have credit cards in this world? Wow. I really should go pay her back myself, hmm. But my old back is really killing me today, hmm. Ah, Quagsire, you honorable oaf, you. You're an oaf because you forgot, and your back hurts. But you're honorable because you're, you're going back to pay it. Well, you're trying to, but... Ugh, honor! So cool. Alright, we're on it. Oh, we were just about to go... Oh, this is the game's way of making us go to the town no matter what. Mm, sorry for the trouble. I'm counting on you. <laughs> I have to say all of his lines, or at least try to remember to, because I love his lines. It's just so fabulous. Um, oh, so I confirmed this yesterday. If you go to the job list, right, and pick out a bunch of missions for the same dungeon, you can't do them all at once, which, unlike the previous Mystery Dungeon games, you could just pick out, like, ten different missions for one place and just do it all. Wait, did it? Oh, okay. And just do them all, and then you'd be finished with that. It was... A little easier to do everything at once. Also, what the heck? Kecleon Chop looks cool today. Wait, everyone's missing? Oh no, this is not the good. Everyone's shop looks so much cooler today. What is up with that? Maybe I just never noticed them. Whoa! It's like a ghost town. Ah, oh, ghost, no. No es bueno. Did everyone get scared off by the notice after all? No one dares go outside, huh? That's weird. Everyone here is stronger than us. Rampardos, Chilisino, not maybe not Kecleon. I don't know, Kecleons are really strong in the dungeons, but plot-wise, usually not so much. Well, let's go check out the Swanas Inn. She should still be in the restaurant, at least. Alrighty, here are we a go. Also, do I have any boxes to uh, break open? I think I don't, damn it. Mmm, to blows. What's this? From Quagsire, you say? Ray gave Swan of the money. Oh, uh, to settle his bill from yesterday? Uh, I figured he'd get around to it, but thanks for going out of your vo out of your way. It looks like there's still quite a few folks here. That sure is a relief. Oh, you were actually worried, were you? Because of that notice about a sus suspicious black one in the post town? How sweet. But these things happen quite often. I'm not quite particularly worried. Yeah? I feel a bit better hearing you say that, to be honest. Though, don't get me wrong, what I'm about to say is, isn't just about the notice this time, but the town's Pokemon are feeling quite uneasy about things. Tensions running high between Pokemon and quarrels break out all the time. Relationships keep growing worse. Not on my team! Ha <laughs> ha! Cravens! All in all, because po rainbows, all hope denied. Period. What the f is he saying? Look, I love y'all. He's got an accent, but I can't read in an accent. I'm terrible. I'll be first to admit, and all the good folks here in Post Town. Well, we've been finding it mighty hard to take on whole hope since the rainbows left us. It's not just post, post Town Pops. Wait, they're related? Pokemon all around the world are losing any kind of hope they used to have. 
And I don't know why, but if things keep going this way, I feel something really bad's gonna happen sooner or later. Something really bad? Wait, I, I can. What you mean, lad? I can. What you mean, lad? <laughs> Hiccup. Excuse me, but I can. What? You, what does that mean? I'm sorry. I don't understand, sir. I fancy all of us here to feel the same deep down underneath it all. It's fair certain. These feelings that something bad's wrong near to us. And I can't believe I'm actually picking up on the accent. <laughs> and that there be a happy future ahead. Aye. Every least one of us is gonna take your feeling. Or... I can't even understand what I'm saying. But even if we all do, what are we supposed to do about some silly feeling, huh? I, uh, don't know, actually. This vague feeling of dread. A vague feeling of dread. Yeah. I don't know why I went like that. Hmm, that wasn't very cheery. Yeah, it wasn't. But we can't just sit around moping, either. Let's do our best, Ray. I wonder... What Matt really thinks about all this talk of doom and gloom. Hurdy and Ruffley just said that all us Pokemon in this world have been feeling it, didn't they? Then maybe Matt actually feels that way too! Matt, do you feel down? What's the matter? Nothing looks so down about. He's so positive. That's because he was dreaming about bacon again, huh? <laughs> Even just overthinking things. I gotta stay positive too. Yeah, positivity! Woohoo! <laughs> Then let's go and do more missions. All right, and I guess the plotting has uh, happened, and uh, I will see you guys after some mission. Where the frig is everybody? I had a box to open in my dream, in my head. Ever hey missioning time in the way. I just want to get to the missioning part first to make sure it's not a mission-related thing. Yeah. Okay. So nothing interesting is going on. We will check out companion mode next. Time. I'm gonna do a mission. So check the bulletin board. Yes, I will. Um, something difficult would be nice. Hey. I'm gonna try and find something that would be, spring water is probably gonna be something we need. So I'm gonna go out and do a job. I'll see you guys in uh, next time. Question of the day is why the heck are there wasps in my bathroom that I have to keep killing? And uh, yeah, leave a like, subscribe, and all that stuff you guys usually get told to do by everyone else on YouTube because I don't know why. It's just we think you forget, but you probably don't. It's just all up to y'all and stuff, anyways. Why? Stupid freaking wasp. I'd be like, I'd be like, punch, punch, punch. Oh, hey, bye. <laughs>